The allegations against the Mobile Police Chief took another interesting turn today. Mayor Sandy Stimson released a statement saying the allegations had been dropped and that the FBI would be taking over the investigation. Chief James Barber held a news conference this morning to address the allegations himself. News 5's Ashley Knight was there and joins us now live from the newsroom with more. And Ashley, how does the chief seem to be taking all this? Well, Mel, when Chief Barber walked into the room, you could tell he was visibly, visibly frustrated at all of this. And that showed in the statement he made. He told reporters he is not sorry for taking action in an area of town where most officials will not go. Barber also said his advice to Kenneth Paget, the man accusing Barber of pulling the gun, was that next time he's caught in the act of burglary, he suggests calling a lawyer instead of calling his councilman, Fred Richardson. Paget also accused Barber of not wearing a body camera. Barber didn't answer any questions, but did say he wanted to move on to other more important issues of the day. Here is a conversation that I will have with the council. Is as of today, we have buried, we will bury our ninth teenager due to gun violence. No body camera in the world will prevent that. Now coming up, we will have reaction to all of this from Councilman Fred Richardson. For now, live in the newsroom, Ashley Knight, News 5. Yes, we have some uh, reaction from Richardson now. This afternoon, he responded to the criticism he's been receiving. Richardson says he was merely making the mayor's office aware of the complaint. He didn't make the complaint himself. He told News 5's Alan Carter he has no issue with how police handled the situation. If I was the chief, if I was a police officer, I probably would have too. It's, it's a crime in progress. Not knowing what I was up against, not knowing if this person was armed. I probably would have too. I don't, I don't have no qualm with that. And I didn't raise any of those issues about a gun. I didn't raise any issues. It just got into the media that I did that. I'm not, I'm not, fight, I'm not, I'm not saying anything about the police behavior. I think the police did what he's supposed to do. He was doing his job. You're going to hear a lot more from Alan Carter's interview with Fred Richardson. That's tonight on News 5 at 10 o'clock.